the history of World War II is interesting to me, especially the, the history around what's known as the Battle of the Bulge and, and the time in the Ardennes Forest and just an, an ama- and some amazing stuff that went on there. And part of the amazement was because the Allied forces, one particular section of the Allied forces, basically became surrounded. They went so far forward and the others fell back a little bit that they became totally isolated. And it's, it's, it's an amazing story to hear. And the Germans were amazed that they were just so tough that they, they made it through that Christmas time in the middle of the winter there. Because the military thought was, if we can cut them off from their source of supply and strength and reinforcement, that's it. And that's what the enemy is seeking to do to every one of you. As followers and soldiers in the army of Jesus Christ, he says, well, if I can separate you, you are mine. That's what he's doing. That's why when you wake up in the morning, you go, man, I don't know about going to church today. You know, I went last week. I get three out of four Sundays. That's pretty good. That's the enemy of your souls. That's your that's your heart, your wicked heart that we all have going, I'd rather be comfortable and do something for me. And it gets reinforced by the enemy of your soul. Say, that's right. You deserve it. You're a good person. It's trying to cut you off. Trying to cut you off from prayer, trying to cut you off from the Lord God Almighty, that direct line. 